Hi, I'm really excited to show you my new toy that I got today through Amazon. It's the X-Pen Deco One, and it's a drawing tablet. But I really needed something to help me with grading papers. I had my first full-fledged online classes last year, and along with my regular writing classes, I um, taught several students that were out of state. And it was really great experience. I used Zoom to conduct the classes. It was wonderful. The only thing that was a problem was having them turn in their homework. I used ThinkWave um, and my students upload their homework to ThinkWave. I can show you that some other time. But what I would have to do is uh, download the homework, print the homework, grade the homework, scan the homework, and upload the homework back to ThinkWave so they would have it. So I have a lot more online students this year, so I really wanted a way that I could grade papers more easily without all those steps. So after spending about two days looking at options uh, last week, I ordered this Deco One, and it just came today. And I think it's going to revolutionize my grading for my online students. So let me show you, first of all, this is, this is what it looks like. Um, got it hooked up to my computer, USB. Um, this is the pen that comes with it. And you just write on the tablet. It's, it's like using a mouse, except it's a lot more sensitive. I'm still getting used to the um, pen motions and how to make sure I end up with my cursor in the right place on my documents. Um, but I just worked with it for a little while this afternoon and already I'm getting better and I can see that soon it's probably gonna be second nature. And so let me show you an example on a Word document because I tried and tried to find out if this would work with Word and there really wasn't much um, information out there. So this is for all the people that might like to use um, a tablet for grading papers. The great thing about this is it's $60. Um, you know, you can pay a lot of money for tablets and um, $60 is really affordable. And from all the um, information I've read, it just gives excellent service. Now I'm not drawing, but even apparently some graphic designers use it. Um, I'm just using it for grading paper, so I don't need it to be extremely fine. I just need to be able to um, mark and save paper. So let me show you on screen share. Great feature of Zoom. Um, I'm gonna open up Hannah's paper. Hannah was one of my summer students. You have to have the, the Windows Ink program on your computer to be able to use this, and I do. So you hold the stylus near the surface of the tablet and move it to where you want it to be. You don't have to actually be touching the tablet, um, and you just keep lifting and moving until you got, get to where you want it to be. And then when you have it near where you want it, Oh, uh, let's see, I've lost my pen again. Let's try that again. So if I wanted to say, make a comment about um, her heading, which is beautiful and perfect, I could just write on there. Um, great job on heading. And I like to use lots of smiley faces for my students. I can actually, mark particular things like here she needed some quotation marks around the title the, ar the article title so i just put it on there with a p for punctuation um, that didn't work out too well so i'm going to go back up here and hit eraser and let's see i'm gonna fix my mark i made there and get rid of that there we go. Now I'll do pen again. And make some better quotation marks. 
And again, it's a little slow right now, but I'm just getting used to the tool. So soon I'll be able to, I'm just sure, just slide through grading like I do when I'm hand grading on paper. And then all I have to do when I'm done is actually save the Word document and all of the marks that I made will be saved as well. Then I just upload it back to the grading site. No printing, no scanning. It's so easy compared to what I've been doing. So teachers that need to grade online papers, this would be a great option for you and it doesn't cost that much. $60 on Amazon. Give it a try.